Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some more nice slivers. We won the die roll against Ludal. Uh, looks like we have a pretty crummy... Well, nah, this is fine. We'll keep it. We can winding way, refill. It's all right. It's, it's not very powerful, but uh, hopefully our winding way will pop us off here. All right, come on. Everybody's playing slow today. Went up against our Bogle guy, brand new to the game. Didn't quite know how to do it yet. Um, then we had... Before that, I played Affinity, but they disconnected from the match and were taking a super long time. They had lethal on me for like a year, and it took them forever to figure it out. I ended up cutting that game, though, because uh, they were disconnecting. and It was one of those games where I'm like, yeah, I, I want to be able to see how the rest of that game would have went if I was to post it. All right, I'm doing it this way so we can get in for some damage and poisonous. That was a good draw on Viverlin. Next turn, we can go Winding Way, holding up a Plains more than likely, and maybe just just try to get another, like, Plated or something like that. Uh, unless they hold up Counterspell, then we're just going to chill and wait. Still got a decent board against Blue. You know, one Flanking, one Plated, and a Poisonous is enough pressure for them for the most part, unless it's, like... Delver and they can start popping off uh, Gurmogs, but it is not. It's Simic. Oh, Simic Mill, lovely. Maybe I don't know what they're doing. Actually, this is this is interesting. Was there other other cards that got played out? I forget. All right, well, same plan. We got another Sidewinder in case we don't hit anything too good with this. All of these are pretty nice. Let's just go another Sidewinder. Attack, attack. Now I'm going to be pissed if they start holding up fogs. I hate these fog mill decks. So annoying. But yeah, I'm trying to think if there's any other downgraded cards from Double Masters. Then maybe that's why we're seeing this. Because you never see this deck. It's rare. It's very rare. And they just want to go to the next game. See how much uh, how much pressure that can build up. Next turn, we're dropping a lord. Two lords, probably. Yep. That's fine. All right. So if this is mill, I'm going to assume they have that crap. I guess we'll bring in a spinner out. We'll take out one of these. Hunter doesn't seem super relevant. I want that. I want that. We can take out one of these. I want to keep my gem hides. Do we need anything else? Relic? For Simic? See, I'm, gonna, I'm just kind of lost as to what we're playing against, so I don't want to go too crazy. I think Flaring Pain is a good assumption that they'll be playing with some moments peace. But like Simic? What is this? Like a Simic Delver? I'm not sure what we're up against. So I, until I know otherwise, this is how I'm going to run it. We can adjust on game three if we don't beat them. But right now what we know up against Simic and pretty much the only Simic deck that is in pop right now is freaking Mill. So we're going to keep this. We're going to give them their go. They're onto an evolving wild start. Perfectly fine. Perfect. Perfect. Perfectly freaking fine with me. You know what I'm saying? You guys know what I'm saying. We're getting lords for days. We're just going to put down a sidewinder past the turn. See what's up. Look at all these beauty boys. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wonderful. Gain a life. It ain't going to matter. It ain't going to matter. Oh, that matters. You suck. Fine. Whatever, man. What does that give them? Negative one. All right. So just putting a lord down can play around that. But you know what? I like this better. Let's do that poisonous game again, shall we? I like it. Well, we could have played turn one plated, but you know, it is what it is. Another side wiener. I think I just play a Lord here. No force spike. 
I don't know what we're up against. This is still bizarre to me. I didn't. I'm not seeing the mill. I'm seeing piracy charm. I don't know. You got me. If we get close to killing him, maybe I'll ask. I'm just gonna ask now. See, they keep hitting themselves with their thought scour, so I'm, uh, I'm genuinely curious as to what this is. Maybe it's not appropriate for me to ask right now since we're still mid-game, but I don't want to have them leave in frustration and not find out without asking. So they're holding up a counter spell. We just saw that they grabbed it. Um, hmm. Man, I really want to get down a plate. It. It's it's kind of a bummer. Or a sidewinder. He says, UG trash. That's funny. Um, pass. Pass. Yeah, we'll just pass. They're holding up counter spell. They'll counter my sidewinder plated. That's annoying. Bouncing, my lord. Give me more lands. I want more lands. If I can drop another Sidewinder, that'd be pretty nice. There's a land. Not the land I'm really looking for, though. Let's see if we can sneak one of these in. They allow it. All right. Uh, we pass again. We're just going to play patient. They're just trying to hold up counter spells. That's fine. We got six cards in hand. We got five. Go, go, go. So you're going to vapor snag another thing? Stop setting me back, man. All right, good. They're stuck on the two... Mountains, though, too. All right, so Nimble Mongoose. It gets plus two as long as you have seven more cards in your graveyard. He does not have the threshold yet. He has six cards, but he can easily get there, which means he'll become a 3-3. Three, three. We're in a bit of an awkward spot. I think we just play Lord while we can, though. So the two threes, this one will become a two two with the flanking, so we can attack in here now. Maybe they double block something, but fine, so be it. Oh man, wait, I'm not even playing around the vapor snag play. Oh shoot, they could have vapor snag and just decimate me right now. That's a misplay. Doesn't look like they are. They're letting the flanking go through. Here we go. Oh, they're going to do that? Okay. Uh, interesting. Just gave him plus two, minus... That's fine. We're just going to trade. Uh, perfectly reasonable. Okay, go ahead. Nimble Mongoose is a 3-3. Less scary than Delver, though. No flying here. Another one. That's kind of annoying, though. I'll be honest. Mountain. Interesting. What do I want to do here? Awkward situation. want to play both these lords down like right freaking now I could refill I don't know my man is kind of in an awkward spot just 
striking, another sinew, a gem hide, a gem hide. Perfect. I want these gem hides. We can't play them this turn, though. But next turn, we can go off. All right, they're two fours. I don't want to take a chance on a double block, not without the flanking and stuff. So we're going to just pass turn and turn this music down just a hair because that one is like extra loud. All right. I'm wondering if they're going to hold up a counter spell here. Probably. Counter me, bro. Not going to counter me. All right, cool. So, let's go ahead and drop down a sinew. See if they want to counter that. They will, that's fine. We've got more where that came from. There's another one. Uh, let's diversify, playing around some garbage like uh, whatchamacallit. But they don't want to see it. They're done. They know I've got two lords on the way. We're drawing another plane. I mean, we were about to pop off. They couldn't do anything. Uh, sorry, man. It is a little bit of UG trash. I don't know what really the end game here is for you, but... Mill yourself and find a bunch of Threshold guys, I guess. I wonder if they're playing with Jace's Phantasm, if that's the case. Maybe they are. Um, interesting. But, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that matchup. Interesting little Simic build they got going here. I'll find a nicer name than UG Trash, I promise. I'll make something up. <laughs> but leave a like. Make sure to subscribe for more Nia Slivers and more fun. Tomorrow we've got a Call of Duty video coming out. Stay tuned for that. We'll see you on Sunday for a Sunday booster cracking into Force of Will. And we'll see you guys in the next video.